Hey everyone, thanks for tuning into Crypto ZX. I really appreciate you stopping by my channel today. To all my viewers watching my video right now, can I please ask you guys to smash that like button and hit the red subscribe button if you haven't already. This does help with the channel tremendously and it also keeps me motivated on making videos for you guys. But with that being said, let's jump right in today's content. Alright guys, before I begin, I would like to say the disclaimer, anything on this channel should not be taken as financial advice because I am not a financial advisor. Cryptocurrencies are super volatile, so please do your own due diligence and research before investing in these markets. If we're looking at the overall crypto market cap today, we're currently sitting at $2.35 trillion, down 0.1% in the last 24 hours. Meanwhile, BTC dominance is currently sitting at 44.5%. If we're looking at the overall markets in the last 7 days especially, we are seeing a lot of green across the board we did see a minor correction but nothing to worry about in my opinion um i believe this is still the next leg up for the cryptocurrency markets as a whole but uh today i want to talk about none other than cardano guys so if we're looking at ada's price right now cardano is currently trading at one dollar 31 cents and uh, you know it's down 3.7 percent in the last 24 hours in usd comparative it's up 1.2 percent in btc comparative in the last 24 hours uh, cardano's current rank on coin market cap and on coin gecko is top seven and market cap right now is 42 billion dollars meanwhile 24 hour trading volume is four billion dollars so the volume has uh, picked up a bit uh, if we're zooming out and looking at the bigger picture in just the last year alone ada is up a staggering 2537 percent so everything is looking very very nice for ada uh, but today i want to share an article with you guys and then we will come and do our price analysis on ada um, Oakum.fi and uh, Bondly bring next generation DeFi and NFT capabilities to Cardano. Um, so, uh, the Oakum Association and Bondly, the interoperability, transparent and portable swap protocol designed to revolutionize traditional escrow uh, methods uh, that empower uh, the next generation of NFT creators announced to, uh, today their strategic partnership for the Oakum.fi ecosystem. To launch the partnership, Bonly will work with Oakum.fi to use its proven NFT technology to bring high utility NFT capabilities to the Cardano ecosystem. Mark Berger, president of Oakum Association, says Bonly has emerged as an NFT leader, and together we believed our partnerships and, by extension, the Cardano ecosystem is a natural fit. Together, we will pursue opportunities to uh, incubate NFT startups and bring high-quality projects across our respective launchpad infrastructure. In late 2020, IOHK, the engineering company behind Cardano, announced a partnership with Bonly with Dan Friedman, a business development manager at IOHK, serving as an advisor to the Bonly team. Brandon Smith, CEO of Bonly, says... Uh, throughout a combination of our NFT capabilities and Oakum.fi's DEX and Launchpad technology, every collaborative project will be set up for multi-chain success. Our deep experience in the NFT market is a natural fit to rapidly grow to uh, rapidly grow the untapped potential for the NFTs within the Cardano ecosystem. Bonly has occurred a deep experience in the NFT area. Uh, NFT market and area of rapid growth but untapped potential for the Cardano ecosystem. Together with Bondly, it is expected that the best and most uh, disruptive NFT enterprises can be accelerated through the IDO raises on the Oakum Razor launchpad. Very, very interesting. But now let's jump into the price and see what the price is doing. So, first off, we did see a minor, minor pullback. So do not panic guys and do not call this a big shake off a big uh, market crash we just came down uh, 8% very very you know um healthy in my opinion so what maybe caused that so uh, bitcoin was trading at around $58,000 yesterday but it had a retracement at to all the way down to $54,000 and this is a prime example I always say this on my channel Bitcoin is the leading indicator of the market uh, big whales <clears throat> with a big amount of bitcoins uh, do tend to take profits and you know when Bitcoin goes down uh, even five to ten percent altcoins will definitely go down with it most of the time and that's exactly what happened but this was not a flash crash this was just a minor correction nothing to worry about in my opinion just a small dip that occurred we're still you know looking very very bullish in my opinion uh you know i believe in just the next coming days i strongly believe in just the next coming days we are about to finally enter in this upwards range upwards trend range and just smash past this level of resistance guys this level of resistance 
once we finally break it for good and we finally smash past our new all-time high guys this is going to be a very, um, you know, uh, exciting time for the Cardano community because, you know, this, uh, as I have mentioned, this is a very, very strong level of uh, resistance for Cardano. As you guys can see, I uh, tried to break it once, twice, nothing happened, finally broke it third time. But, you know, I was unable to hold it. And then obviously, uh, Bitcoin, a flash crash also occurred during this time. So it did not play out in the favor of Cardano at all. But this is part of the markets and we have to be prepared for these kind of corrections and always be patient because I always stress on this channel, patience is your number one key and always invest where you can afford to lose. Never throw your life savings into crypto and always do your own due diligence. As long as you do all those, uh, patience would be your number one key and you never want to be shaken out during these kind of dips, especially flash crashes because they do not last long and um, you know, you do not want to be shaken out because the markets recover very fast. As you guys can see, since this flash crash, for instance, the one that we saw, uh, Bitcoin is back. Uh, I mean, um, Cardano is back up a staggering uh, to 40%. So that goes to show you do not want to be shaken out. But everything is looking very, very nice for ADA right now. The thing is, we need a little bit more buying pressure to kick in in order for us to really see some price action to occur. But like I said, the month of May is the month where we are about to see ADA its all-time high. And I'm very, very confident about that. Once we smash past this all-time high, guys, and uh, we will like literally go straight to do two dollars because there's no level of resistance there's nothing up there as uh, sky is the limit at that point but i believe two dollars is a psychological point where people will tend to take some profits and we could see some choppiness around that after that like we could pull down back to this a uh, level to even one dollar eighty cents very very possible in my opinion but two dollars i believe uh will come this uh, month of may I know guys, I know this consolidation has been, uh, you know, for a while and it might be boring, but at the end of the day, I always say this, um, you know, I always mention this on my video, nothing is going to go up straight forever and in crypto consolidations are very normal, such as these. And, you know, sometimes consolidations are even longer. So, uh, you know, you have to have patience. And I'm sorry if you think uh, crypto markets just go up in one straight line. That's unrealistic. I'm sorry to break that to you. Uh, markets do not go up in one straight line uh, because that's a pump and dump. And, um, you know, the consolidations are very much needed. Some, you know, uh, corrections and always do occur in cryptocurrency markets. And you have to, uh, you know, um, keep that in mind because like i said nothing goes up straight forever and um, if you thought it did i'm sorry to break it to you it does not so uh, like i said patience is your number one key cardano holders you guys know um you guys know you guys are here for the long term and um uh, staking would be the best option but with that being said always do have some sort of exit strategy in place if the money that you have invested is too much uh, that you cannot lose i cannot stress this enough guys because if you bought back up early on you know you should always have some sort of exit strategy in place where you would uh you know take profits and lock in some profits because at the end of the day we are here to make money and you want to lock in some profits uh but yeah everything is looking very very nice uh, bullish for a uh, you know ada i believe <coughs> i'm sorry i believe it's just a matter of time when where we finally break out of this um you know crucial uh, you know um, resistance level and then we're off to the races uh, for ADA and you know Cardano holders that have been holding will be rewarded heavily like absolutely heavily and you know two dollars is just a short term uh, target my my you know like overall target is way above that as because you know a lot of analysts are also calling uh, for uh, you know this altcoin season to be the biggest altcoin season of the cryptocurrency markets if that were to occur guys ada will uh, see some crazy crazy numbers and um you know obviously there's a lot of institutional interest a lot of developer interest building up on ada and as you guys can see um there's 31 billion dollars ada being staked right now 31 billion dollars ada being staked right now 85 percent of the circulation supply that alone guys that alone gets me super bullish that goes to show that goes to show how huge the community is and how much you know a people believe in the project because 31 billion you know dollars worth of ada is being staked right now that's absolutely insane and though 31 billion ada is out of the so you know um out of the you know circulation in my opinion uh because it's not on the exchanges that's being staked right now so 
when the demand really does kick in we do see that next leg up we see that breakout there's going to be uh, you know less coins on the exchanges and what happens then you know supply and demand major uh, you know uh, basic economic rule um, comes in so once there's a higher demand and there's less supply less coins on the exchanges you know sky is the limit and you know cardano will skyrocket uh, but uh, you know everything is looking very very bullish we're still in this range there's a, a strong level of support even if we fall further down to this level very very strong level of support at that point 50 Fibonacci retracement level but now if Bitcoin were to have a flash crash further down then yes definitely we could see um, some lower um, you know price action then we could definitely go back down to the 61.8 range uh, there's a, a lot of support around that level which is around that one dollar range I do not see that happening right now. As I mentioned, you know, the momentum of the market is very bullish. We just recently hit a new all-time high for the entire cryptocurrency market. So the bullish scenario is definitely outweighing the bearish scenario as of now. But there's always a possibility that we have to keep in mind for the bearish scenario to occur. And it's very possible. Uh, but uh, yeah, you guys have to be ready for those kind of uh, corrections to occur. If the money that you have, uh, you know, is too much that you cannot afford to lose, then I definitely encourage you guys to have um, some sort of exit strategy in place that I always say for you guys to have. If the money that you have invested is that you, you know you cannot afford to lose at all. But even but if you're in it for the long haul, guys, you guys know you guys know what to do uh, in in that case. But with that being said, guys. Uh, you know, I think I am going to wrap up uh, today's video around here. Um, you know, stay safe out there. Safety comes first, health comes first, family comes first, and everything else absolutely comes later. And let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section where you could see ADA being traded at at the end of May. I would love to know your thoughts down below. And guys, stay safe out there. Safety comes first, health comes first, family comes first, and everything else absolutely comes later. And um, with that being said, guys, um, you know, thank you so much for all the support. I really appreciate each and every single... Uh, each and every one of you guys really from the bottom of my heart i really appreciate each and every one of you guys and um you know i think that's it for today's video it's been crypto zx and peace out